What's up everybody? It is me again, Destiny, and today in this video I have a super exciting video, something a little bit different, but still a smoking video. We will be getting lit, because it's always lit on the life of being Destiny, you feel me? But today in this video, I'm super excited, because I'm going to be sharing with you guys what it is that I keep in my purse. I'm yet to film a What's in My Purse video up on my channel, and I recently just bought this new baby, so I thought it was a perfect time to do this type of video. So yeah, let's just get right on it. To it. By the way, if you guys haven't noticed, I am rocking a Life Being Dust hat. It's super dope. It's a light pink color with pot leaves. Super duper dope. If you guys didn't already know, I do have a website selling merchandise including jewelry, t-shirts, and hats. Feel free to check it out. LifeBeingDust.BigCartel.com is my website. Link will be down below in the description. And if you guys do want to make a purchase, be sure to use the code AWESOME to get 10% off because y'all are popping and y'all are some awesome supporters. So thank you so much. Let me show you what is in here. So this is my purse that I will be showing you guys what is in today. It's very, very, very tiny. It's a super cute vanilla like Michael Kors. And then it has this really cute like light pink overlay with this nice like little, I don't even know what you would call that. And then you just like move it like that. And then you can take it out, you feel me? I don't know. It's like a clasp kind of thing. I enjoy it. It's a little bit more interesting than just a plain zipper. So it's really fun and I'm a huge fan of this like vanilla pattern of the Michael Kors but I love how not the whole purse is that pattern. It has like the pink, super cute. The strap is a crossbody and yeah. So, and also in the back here it's super dope. You can just stuff in any like receipts or money or something, something, something. But yeah, so this is what it looks like. It's like already like over fucking flowed. So the first thing I see you guys is my wax pen. So a lot of you guys who do have me on Snapchat, Life Being Dust is my username. Be sure to add me on all social media. A lot of you guys have been non-stop asking me on all over, all over social media, all different platforms, which vaporizer it is that I'm using. When I was on my way to the LA premiere, you guys know it was a long drive for me and I couldn't just be like hotboxing the car. So what's super dope is that I had this super handy dandy wax pen with me the whole time and it was just a1 perfect got me super schmack super blown and it was just super easy for the go so yeah I'll have a link down below so you guys can go ahead and purchase this product but this is called the evolve plus XL it just looks like that it's pretty big but what I love about this that I haven't seen in any other wax pen is that it has a super dope compartment down here where you can store your wax but it is split in half so if you guys have two different kind of concentrates like a crumble and like a shatter or just two different strains you guys could totally keep it nice and organized and separated so I thought that was super duper fun super perfect for like a road trip or a camping trip or somewhere where you're gonna be where you can't necessarily like smoke like from a rig you gotta be more low-key and use maybe a wax pen and you're gonna be there for several days or weeks or whatever this is perfect because it's like pretty big where you could store probably a to like a gram in this little compartment so that's super dope and then it has a super nice sleek magnetic top which makes it super easy whenever you need to like repack a bowl and then you just twist off that top and then there's like coils in there where you put your wax so I'm actually gonna go ahead and pack a bowl and then to turn on the wax pen you just press it five times and there's different heat settings you could change it to but I just use like the same setting every time and it has this super adorable baby dabber it comes with I'm so obsessed again I've never seen something like this in a like wax pen type of kit so this is a little dabber it has a scoopy end for like a crumble or something like that and then it has a like pointy end which is perfect when it comes to like packing some shatter or something like that so I love how it's like double-ended tiny perfect for the go fits in my purse you feel me when you don't have the biggest purse so super, super handy and portable. Dope! And that was just a baby hit. I didn't like hit it all the way through. You could hold it down until, until the light starts blinking, but I always just can't handle it. I can never take that out of a hit, so yep but moving on what else i got in my purse let's see here oh of course my phone everybody keeps their phone in their purse or in their pocket or something but um yeah 
it would have been an iPod before so your girl's upgrading you guys already know that I've had this for a while now but super dope is that I have this spec case on it it's like all glittery I kind of want to get like the those cases like where you move it and the glitter like moves with it like those are so dope but I like this one because it was kind of clear like see-through but not completely see-through like see-through but like with the little sparkle you feel me and then I put my life being death sticker in there which is super super dope and yeah if you guys haven't already be sure to go cop yourself a sticker link is in the description use the code sticker to get a free sticker you guys you already know desk got you because we all trying to be ballers on a budget oh this wag plan is so nice you guys perfect for the go i'm telling you and then I also have my headphones. I low-key hate the fact that the iPhone 7 does not have, like, a, a thing for, like, an aux cord. I always forget, and I'm always, like, fighting for the aux cord. And then I finally, as soon as I get my way, and it's like, okay, guys, you can put music. Here's the aux cord. I go, and I look at my phone, and I'm just like, oh, my goodness. Like, never mind, you guys. <laughs> Moving on <coughs> in my purse. I'm, like, dying from that dab. <coughs> I would have always thought that, you know, hitting wax from a pen is just not comparable to hitting wax from a rig. But actually, it kind of is, depending if you guys get the right wax pens. Alright, so I also have this little baby wallet in my purse. This one's perfect because it's super tiny and just basic for what it is I need. I don't carry much in my purse. I don't have, like, a bunch of credit cards. I only have my one card and then maybe my ID and, like, cash if I have any but I'm like a broke bitch so probably not um yeah this is from forever 21 it was eight dollars <coughs> you know what I love this because it is just basic and tiny perfect for school perfect for your purse perfect on the go just hold it in your hand if you need it to so yeah it just looks like a normal wallet you feel me Maybe one day I could pull up with that Louis V wallet, but <laughs> for now, <laughs> we gonna stay dreaming. Alright, I have a, act what the fuck? I actually have stick, I mean, stickers. I have pictures in my purse. Okay, so last I used this purse, I was at the Super High premiere, so this is a little strip of photos from the photo booth. As you guys could tell, it says Super High down here. Super dope. These these are really cute. I need to post these on Instagrams. But um yeah, I also got these 420 wipes. I only have two in here, but I have like a million 420 wipes, so whenever I run out, I could just restock. And yeah, these come in clutch because then I also got myself a hair tie. I kind of stopped wearing hair I try to stop myself from wearing hair ties on my wrist just because when I take photos it doesn't look cute. I did a photo shoot and I totally forgot to take the hair tie off my wrist and it was like the worst thing ever. It was like so aggravating for me. So I prefer to keep one in my bag just in case I do need one. And then the last but not least thing that I have in my purse are these mints. I love these you guys. Be sure to check out their Instagram, Milo Confessions. I honestly love these so much when I'm in a situation where it's like a public situation or like a businessy situation and I'm just very anxious or nervous and like I don't know like when it comes to talking to professional people I get very nervous sometimes because like I don't know I want to sound professional too but I'm like just me and I'm like mm, mm, mm. so pop in a mint is the best no I'm just kidding just the fact that I know these have 20 milligrams in each mint it kind of just tricks my mind into thinking like okay like I'm relaxed like just by literally taking it don't even feel different don't feel high at all but just you know taking it it kind of tricks your mind into thinking that anyways so really 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 dope I love these and yeah they really do help and they're tasty and at the same time they help your breath they help so y'all need to go get you some Milo mints you feel me that concludes the end of this what's in my purse video there's literally nothing in here you guys nothing in there at all it's literally so tiny if it's my phone and my wallet and like my pen and that's it but that's exactly what I need you know especially for like events like premieres or like we're gonna walk on a runway or something 
a runway yeah right when you walk on a carpet or something like that you know you want to have something to keep your phone in but at the same time have your hands free so something like this that is crossbody and whatnot is super adorable You guys, this is my favorite wax pen right now. You seriously need to be sure to check it out. Like I said, link will be down below in the description. So check that out, you guys. Thank you so, so, so much for watching my video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope you guys have an amazing rest of your guys' day. I hope my video was able to make your day a little bit brighter. And if it was, you already know, be sure to smash that thumbs up button. It'll make my day even brighter. So thank you so much for the endless support you guys always give me. Much love for me to you. Be sure to hit that subscribe button to become part of the Life of Being Dust fam if you haven't already. But most importantly, do not forget to stay lit, stay up, and stay positive, you guys. Double deuce. Until next time.